Hello and welcome back to another epic episode of the Private Property Home Shopper Show. Today we are touring a mesmerizing home right here in the incredible Blair Athol Golf and Equestrian Estate. This home offers jaw-dropping fairway views with a stunning backdrop of the Michalisburg Mountains of which you can see from almost every room. The home boasts five bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms, a three-car garage and so much more, all for 16 million rand. But before we tour this incredible home behind me, let me let you know that you can find your new home on privateproperty.co.za and don't forget to buy tickets for the Cape Town Property Show before they run out. All details in the description below. My name is Chad Riveros. This is the Private Property Home Shopper Show. Welcome home. Approaching this house, regardless of doing it on car or on foot, you know you're in for something special. Walking over that wooden bridge, the pond just below you, approaching those two massive wood doors inlaid with glass, and taking your first steps within the house, you see that all of those thoughts have come true and were correct. You've got these two flowing staircases leading to the upstairs area. That's where all the bedrooms are located. The south end of the home has an office, a bed sit, and the first bedroom, and the only bedroom re really, other than the bed sit that's located downstairs. And the north side of the home has all of the living areas. But right in front of you has to be some of the most incredible views that I think you can get anywhere in the Blair Athol Estate, as well as a manicured garden, your very own private river and then a room flow pool that we'll be showing you later on in the episode so don't go anywhere where we're going to start out is the living areas follow me Another set of wood double doors leads you into your living areas and there's a couple of features right here that I'd like to point out. One behind me, you've got a walk-in wine cellar, not only with your wine racks, but also with a built-in fridge. And then just to the right of that, you've got your guest toilet situated very close to the entrance area with all the trappings you'd want in a guest toilet. But just through this archway, this is your kitchen. It's beautifully situated in this home, overlooking your lounge area as well as your dining room area. It really is built as an entertainer's home. You're able to interact with your family, with your friends or any guests that come here without feeling out of the action while you're prepping meals. You've got your prep sink as well as those really cool plugs that pop out of your center islands right over here. So if you are using more appliances, you've got yourself covered. Up above us, really nice down lighting that is also transitioned onto your ceiling, giving you all the light you might need. A really cool feature in this kitchen has to be the central air conditioning, blowing air in, keeping you nice and cool. Space for a double door fridge, which is I know a feature a lot of us want. And then on my right hand side, we've got a roller door that hides your coffee area, keeping this area very neat and tidy. You've got a freestanding stove with a five top gas burner, extractor fan here, hidden behind the skirting, again, keeping the lines very clean in this kitchen. And then also a built in microwave oven with more cupboard space. Now behind me right here, behind that door, you've got your scullery area. It comes with a dry goods storage area, plenty of cupboard space, your double sink, as well as access to your garden. So anything that you don't see here, such as your washing machine, your tumble dryer, or even your dishwasher, you'll find in your scullery area with all of that under counter storage. But moving forward, you've got a stunning sun deck, and we're going to that next. And now we get to walk down and enjoy this incredible sunroom. Two chairs are placed here for you to overlook something can, that can only be described as an incredibly beautiful garden. Up above me, you've got a skylight with built-in shutters. So if you are worried about the sun, you don't need to be because we can shut that out. Blind is also built in and two fully foldable, stackable glass doors really let you enjoy nature, which is all that Blair Athol is really about. You're so close to incredible bits of nature and this home lets you enjoy it. For those that don't know, Blair Athol is a Gary Player certified golf course ranked six in the world. And this home not only enjoys that, but enjoys so many trappings such as that half garage. You can fit two golf carts as well as a motorcycle and bicycles in there. So you can enjoy the trails, the mountain biking trails, hiking trails. The home is built for convenience and you're gonna see so much more of it as we walk into this lounge. Follow me. 
As you walk into the lounge area, you'll see not only is it spacious, but beautifully lit. We've closed the blinds behind us so you can see how you can block out light as you see fit. The home, when we speak about convenience, has not only a home automation system that I'm gonna show you in just a moment, but also central air conditioning, central vacuuming, and then as well as this very cool feature, Echo TV on. The home is about comfort, about sitting down, relaxing with friends, with family, and enjoying the sights, the sounds of nature, but also the space it has while still remaining very, very comfortable. So we've shown you the kitchen, we've shown you the sunroom, we've shown you this lounge suite with the beautiful fireplace and all the incredible features such as the bulkhead down lighting. It's now time to show you the dining room area before we move out onto the outside, the deck, the pool, the garden. Those are things you definitely don't wanna miss. Come with me. And yeah, beautifully tucked away in a sunlit and beautifully decorated corner is your dining room table. We've got two, four, six, eight chairs in a very conservative space. Very, very easy for you to entertain large groups while this doesn't take up a huge amount of space like those long tables we see so often does. I love the chandelier draping down, but my favorite has to be this. A set of slidable and stackable doors right here, as well as one right in front of me, leading immediately out onto your outdoor area. You can see we're passing the lounge suite here, but this is what I'd expect an outdoor area to be, a patio. We've got tons and tons of space for you to utilize as you wish. You've got your lounge suite there. You've got your dining room table here, another one. Then South Africa's favorite pastime, the braai, right underneath an extractor fan here. And this is an industrial extractor fan. So you can braai during any time of the year. Over here, prep area, as well as prep sink with your undercounter storage access to the back garden that we saw from the sunroom and walking forward you're coming to the pillars that basically terminate the patio area but we've got built-in weather shades that come all the way down and lock into hooks cemented in the floor so this does become quite an indoor area if the weather isn't favorable but when the weather is favorable this is exactly where you're going to be wanting to spend all your time a beautiful wood deck overlooking the 17th hole of that gary player golf course that i spoke about you can see the restaurant all the way out in the distance. That is a world-class restaurant. There's so much to do within this estate. They've got 17 different fishing dams. I believe three or four of them are trout dams. So if you are a big fisherman, you know you're gonna be covered here. But if you're not into fishing and you'd rather kick back with a mimosa or cocktail and enjoy this deck area, you've got this pool right over here that is room flow and it does have some amazing views. Put a lilo down and really sit back and enjoy your success. Another very, very cool thing about this garden is it's very large. It extends all the way down to another sun deck all the way in the corner of it that you can sit down, enjoy maybe another braai or even light up a small bonfire and toast up some marshmallows. But my favorite feature has to be this over here. All the way Beginning at the top of the house, you have your very own private river that runs all the way down in a waterfall, down all the way to the corner of your garden, right where that other sun deck is. You can see the trout in it. What a cool feature to have in a home that's yours. I love the outside area and wait until you see this area from the top of the master suite. I promise you it's a view you don't wanna miss out on. Follow me. And now we are back inside the house and it's time to explore the south end that we saw right at the beginning of the video. Behind me, you've got your office area. Now this office area is purpose built for you to get your work done. You have access not only to your patio, but you've also got a Juliet balcony overlooking your koi pond in that river that we spoke about. You can sit there, de-stress, focus your mind and then sit back down at your office table and really get to the nitty gritties of your work. Love that it's been included and in a perfect spot in my opinion. But a little bit further along, you come to a bed sit on my right hand side and a storage room on my left. Let's go explore what a bed sit is, what it means and why you're gonna be so lucky to have one in your home. A bed sit is essentially a studio apartment attached to your home. Typically, there's a connected bathroom, a kitchenette, and space for both a seating area and a bed. As you can see, this bed sit ticks all the boxes. The quaint ensuite bathroom has everything you need, including a stunning vanity and a large walk-in shower. This space is absolutely perfect for your older kids, allowing them a sense of autonomy and privacy. 
It's also a great option for long-term guests or your in-laws. Now, rounding off the ground floor of this home is the first bedroom other than the bedsit located in the corner of the home. Now, this bedroom has utilized space rather smartly. So, one, it also has access from outside, just like what we saw in the bedsit. So, if you have got guests here, all of them can come and go as they please without disturbing anybody. It's got a lot of cupboard space, plenty of space for your bed, as well as a sitting area here with some windows letting in a lot of natural light. But what I think the killer feature is for this bedroom isn't the air conditioning, isn't the decorations, isn't the fantastic views. That's what's behind me. That's your ensuite bathroom. You've got a jacuzzi bathtub situated in the corner, double vanities, and a stunningly large shower for you to sit, relax, and wash all of your woes away. Because living in a home like this most certainly is going to make sure you're very, very happy. And now it's time for us to head straight back to that front door over there and walk upstairs and see exactly what the bedrooms on the top floor have in store for us. And here we are back where we started, but this time we get to enjoy taking this flowing staircase all the way up to the top level. Now, not only do we have oak engineered floors, but that's mirrored on the balustrades right here. And the wood details continue onto the balustrade. It's a lovely detail that works so well with the wrought iron. But here we are within the top level. This is generally dedicated to a pajama lounge, but right now it's playing towards the house strength. And that is views. This is a home that you're going to be sitting back relaxing and enjoying the incredible views that the home has to offer. And this additional Juliet balcony really does just that. You can overlook your patio as well as the incredible views in Blair Athol. And now leaving this incredible view behind, it's time for us to take a look at the first bedroom upstairs and it's a Juliet bedroom. Let's go. The first bedroom upstairs is without a doubt, super cozy and comfy, all thanks to warm down lights and the cushy beam carpets. But what makes this room so special are the two French doors that lead onto two separate balconies, making this already large room even bigger. And of course, the cherry on top has to be those gorgeous views. The ensuite bathroom comes fully equipped with a double vanity, a large shower and a stunning corner bath. Even better, this bathroom is also connected to the second upstairs bedroom. While slightly smaller, this room is just as impressive. It has the same cozy carpets and warm down lights, making it the perfect space for your kids to sit and relax. It also has access to a massive balcony overlooking lush green trees. And we've saved the best for last. It's finally time for us to take a look at this master suite in this incredible 16 million rand home. And here we are finally in our master suite. And as you can see, coming through those doors, you end up in your walk-in closet. Now the cupboard space behind me is the perfect spot for all of your favorite outfits. But this master suite hides something so much cooler. And that is your very own kitchenette. You can see the marble countertop, under counter storage, prep sink, as well as plug points allow you to enjoy your favorite cup of coffee, a hot cup of tea, or even your favorite snack without having to venture downstairs. But this master suite has so much more in store for us. So come along with me and let's check it out. Plush carpets lead you into the rest of this master suite. And let me tell you, we've used the word breathtaking often and never more does it apply to something like it has to this home. Walking into this master suite, you've got a wall filled with glass, letting you overlook not only your stunning garden, 
with your river snaking through it all the way down to the sun area or the sun deck should I say but you've got almost 180 degree views of the rest of the Blair Athol Gulf and Equestrian Estate. You can see the mists shift through the forests. It is undeniably one of the best views I think you could ever wake up to. And this bedroom has got it. It's got plenty of space, it's got beautiful lighting, it's got bulkhead ceilings and air conditioning. But the reason you'd be buying this home and the reason this is the master suite is without a doubt this incredible view. So let me stop talking. Let me meet you out on that balcony and why don't you enjoy some cutaways of what you're going to see if you wake up here every morning. And as you can see, views like this without a doubt speak for themselves. Almost everywhere you look in this home, specifically within this master suite, there is a view that's going to take your breath away. But with incredible views, you really do need a place, an incredible place for you to enjoy them. And there's a place like that right over here. Come with me, I think you can enjoy it. And here it is right here, your very own private jacuzzi, built in a place where you can enjoy those amazing views, can you imagine nighttime in this warm jacuzzi, the cold Blair Athol air surrounding you, jets on, lights on, and just enjoying the sights and sounds of nature. I think it sounds very good. I love this. I've always been a huge fan for jacuzzis, but if a jacuzzi isn't your thing, this bathroom most certainly is going to be. Unfortunately, that is all we have time for today. But before we head out, let's talk about what you'll get if you make this incredible home yours. Five bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms, a three car garage, incredible views, and the peace and serenity of knowing you stay in one of the most upmarket and exclusive estates in South Africa, Blair Athol Golf and Equestrian Estate, all for 16 million rand. Now, if you'd like to make this home yours, please contact Alexandra Bentley from Chase Everett. All of her details on screen right now. And a huge thank you goes out both to Alexandra Bentley as well as Chase Everett for allowing us to showcase this home and show you all of the incredible features it has to offer. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel so you don't miss out on any other incredible South African homes. Better yet, hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on the Private Property Podcast or any other episodes of the Private Property Home Shoppers Show. Last but not least, buy your tickets for the property show. We can't wait to see you there. From myself, Chad Rivera, the team at the Private Property Home Shopper Show, thank you so much, and we'll see you next time.